Oh. I was here this morning. Funny. Right, uh, this won't take long. Well, you must have uh, spoken to Maureen by now. And you must know what really happened. I'm not bothered about that. I'm innocent. I don't care. You can sit in stock rooms as long as you like. I don't like. I just wanted to let you know what the state of play is. I thought you were coming around here and knocking my block up. <laughs> I don't give a toss about you, lad. Fair enough. I just want to let you know that me and Maureen get on fine and we're giving it another try. Good, I'm glad. But don't be, because it's got nothing to do with you. She deserves a good time. I don't want your opinion. She's a very nice lady. Keep your hands off. What do you mean? Just what I said. Twice now you've got in my way. I turn me back and you make up to her. No, I haven't. Well, I'll tell you something, lad. If you come sniffing round Whoa, again... whoa, sniffing around? I've not been sniffing around. I mean, why should I? Because every woman that you've ever had has dumped you. Your own wife's only happy a few thousand miles away. Well, that's me and you in the same league, isn't it? No. No, come off it. If your idea of the good life is spending a night in Blackpool with Maureen Holdsworth, well, you ought to be pitied rather than laughed at. Listen, Maureen only went with you because she felt sorry for you. That is not the excuse she used at the time, and she's no angel. I'll tell you what, Maureen deserves better than you. Maureen deserves older than me. You're asking for it. Oh, am I? I didn't have to ask Maureen for it. What? Oh, look, 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 Bill, I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. Well, I mean this. Oh! Oh! oh. 